This is a production of Cornell University. We've enjoyed making wines from these, Bruce. Um, the, the red um, has a lot of nice dark berry fruit, so blueberry especially is what many of our sensory panels have indicated, but also a little bit of spice um, and some other dark fruits like black cherry. Um, the white is very much like other aromatic whites in that it's got lots of peach, um, apricot, pineapple, tropical fruits, so along the lines of uh, um, a muscat or a Riesling. As we're getting ready to, uh, to select names for these two new varieties, uh, Anna Catherine had a great idea, and that is, why don't we pull people in the industry for, uh, for name suggestions and get the word out to the public as well. Uh, we had about 1,100 suggestions come in, but we had suggestions coming in from Malaysia and China and uh, Romania. Uh, we had many suggestions for uh, names that relate to Cornell, like uh, Cascadilla Red or A.D. White. We, all, we had several people writing in and suggesting uh, different versions of uh, Stephen Colbert and uh, John Stewart. I propose Stewart for the White and Colbert for the Red. Citrusy and aromatic is refreshing, just like John Stewart and the best news team on television. As for the Red, I'm sure it's brilliant and deep. Just like the Reverend Sir Dr. Stephen T. Most Def Colbert, DFA heavyweight champion of the world. But we're, we're looking for names that uh, would look good on a wine label and help our, our, um, our clientele and our industry to market and sell the wines. And what, what kind of impression would this give you about, about a grape? Well, two irreverent, you know, <laughs> wine drinkers are much more sophisticated than, yes. than what these guys represent. Can you call a grape Stuart? Would anyone <laughs> drink a wine called Stuart? <laughs> so we, we wouldn't want to s s imply perhaps that, you know, I don't know, that conservatives only drink white wine or vice versa. Uh, Shoot, we don't yeah, want to, we want to bring world. this country together. <laughs> well, Anna Catherine, don't forget the way Stephen Colbert came to campus and treated the big red bear, didn't he? <laughs> Shoot them with a cannon? Or we don't condone that kind of behavior at Cornell. And, and, and don't I remember correctly, didn't John Stewart call our region a frozen hellscape? <laughs> it's unbelievable. And, and besides, you know, we make some damn good grapes and wine in this so-called frozen hellscape. Cheers to that.